Hi, I'm Kathy Nelson, the founder of ConnectWorks, speaker, author, executive coach, and creator of the Busy People series. This video program is designed to help you accelerate your business and close those profit leaks. What I'm going to bring to you in these offerings are some insights to coaching yourself. Wouldn't you like to be able to get out of your own way? Because the time you lose when you're stuck costs. It costs you in time, it costs you in money, it costs you in energy, and most of all, it costs you in the momentum that takes you away from other priorities. I hate that, and I know you do too. The team at ConnectWorks, as well as myself, are pretty fanatical about helping you transform the business you have into the business of your wildest dreams. So one of the first issues I want to tackle today is to break the cycle of overwhelm. The visionary leader that you are, the entrepreneur, the very talented person, I know that you have big dreams. And what happens to people with big dreams is that they can see the end result. They can taste it, they can smell it, they can feel it. You can see that goal and you can see it as if it's done. But when you sit down at your desk to do the thing that's in your heart, your mind, or on your goal sheet, you can get overwhelmed. There are so many moving parts on any given project. So one of the first self-coaching tools that I'm going to suggest that you do is to start looking inward. Start with you. So ask yourself, what is it that I'm doing that's making this project harder than it has to be? Is it really me? A lot of times we start looking at what else needs to happen and who else needs to be involved. What are we doing? What am I doing that makes this project harder than it needs to be? What have I added to this project or initiative that doesn't really need to be there? Now, the reason I suggest you start looking inward is because really smart people building businesses, launching products, driving to do the thing that's in your heart to do, I know that you can figure out most of the things to do to get to your end result. But there's almost always a gap. And what will happen is that in the process of observing and thinking about that gap, we fill it in. We think about what else do we need to know? Who else do we need to hire? What other products do we need to buy? Does my website need to be updated? Do I need new collateral? Am I going to need new business cards? Do I need a new elevator pitch? Do you see where I'm going with this process? We've just overloaded ourselves with additional details to actually get this project done. And nothing works as well when it's incomplete or half done. So I want you to get results. I want you to get in and get going. I want you to move past this place because I know that the thing you have in front of you is probably going to create breakthrough for you if you can just get it off your plate. Breakthrough in income, breakthrough in personal, just huge breakthrough. I'll be the first in line to say that I have a, just a few things on my plate that all of a sudden have become overwhelming. Because like you, I've set some pretty major goals this year. I have big things on my mind. I'm, I'm essentially changing the way I do business this year so that we can better serve our clients as we grow. Well, I don't have to tell you, this has put me into a whole new learning curve. So every day I sit down and ask myself, what am I doing to make this so hard? What have I added? I don't need to build a whole ark to get this done. I just need the small boat. So what do I really need to get started? I hope this helps you today. If you're stuck in overwhelm, I ask you to stop, ask yourself, is it me? Have I made it harder than it has to be? What have I added? And what absolutely needs to get done to get me started or to get this project done? I'm Kathy Nelson, helping you get the right message to the right people, show up in the right places, most of all to work in your strengths to get things done. Thanks for joining us.